Hi, I'm Tim Merrick, and we're here at the 2024 Chicago Golf Show. Here we're joined by Sam Spuler of the Amateur Golf Society. Sam, welcome to Chicago, first off. How has the you. show been so far? Oh, it's been great. Thanks for having me, guys. Uh, we've had a, a great time. It's been a lot, of, a lot of good buzz out here so far, and we're just getting started yeah, here on Friday started, afternoon. For sure. So tell us, Amateur Golf Society, a new initiative here in Chicago. Tell us kind of how the idea came about and kind of your guys' background. Yeah, sure. So our, uh, the founder of our company, Dan Hirschberg, was a um, long time entrepreneur, uh, former brewery owner in suburban Philadelphia, uh, our hometown, and uh, his essentially pandemic response when he was owning and operating the brewery was to engage golfers and to start effectively a golf tour. Um, and he did that uh, by partnering with golf courses. One thing led to another to get there, but in the initial days uh, during the pandemic, he wanted to partner with golf, course, golf courses to keep his beer on their shelves, yeah. but also wanted to differentiate and provide the golf courses value by bringing yeah. them golfers. Sure. And one thing led to another, and he got a little grassroots uh, kind of nucleus of golfers together, and uh, you know, one, you know, a, a, a tour and a structured point system on a season-long basis came out of it. Sure. So it's currently just in Philadelphia right now. We're moving into a couple of different markets. Tell us a little bit about why Chicago was, you know, uh, beneficial for you guys moving forward. Yeah. So we're, you know, excited, very excited to uh, call Chicago a, a new home for yeah. Amateur Golf Society. Um, and, you know, we just see that it's just a wealth of great golf in this region. Um, it's an embarrassment of riches, really, the yeah. more I've gotten to know about the golf landscape sure. here, especially the public golf landscape, which yeah. is really where we do a lot of our work in the public golf space. Um, and you know, you guys have been great partners since yeah. since we met, and you know, we've, we've, since we started this project, we've had a vision of taking this thing nationwide, and uh, we're excited to to move west from Philadelphia. Yeah. So we're moving into Chicago. We've talked about the background. Now for the, the the end user here, tell us about how AGS works and, and what people can expect this coming summer. Sure. So we essentially essentially call it, you know, competitive golf on a very flexible schedule. Um, what we mean by that is we will partner with a host course for seven days at a time uh, and build out a calendar um, here in Chicago to go from May 27th, which is Memorial Day, through uh, early October. And we'll uh, publish a, a, a schedule, which is live on our website now, yeah. which we're very excited about, where we are partnering with a golf course for seven days at a time. And uh, members of the Amateur Golf Society can play that golf course one round of 18 holes anytime between Monday morning and Sunday afternoon, yeah. whatever fits your schedule. Uh, we have a proprietary app that members can then log into to, to post their scores and we have some uh, variety of integrations that allow us to just very easily publish a leaderboard so you can see where you rank against other uh, other members that that week um, and we do it you know we'll issue weekly prizes as well as season-long prizes through a, uh, a season-long point system analogous to the FedEx Cup. Awesome. Um, we saw the teaser video the other day that you kind of referenced here. Tell us what courses, some of the courses that may be involved and how people can get involved themselves. Where should they be directed towards? Sure. Uh, so yeah, very excited. Again, there's so many uh, great golf courses yeah. out here. We'll be at Cog Hill this year. We'll be at Ravislow. We'll be at Bolingbrook. Um, and a, a variety of other ones as well all around the Chicagoland area. As far as where you can find us, you can definitely follow us on social media uh, at the AGS Tour uh, or visit us on our website at amateurgolfsociety.com. Um, one thing I want to you know, just call out too is this is kind of a, a tour and a program for everybody. Um, you know, in our membership in Philadelphia, we've had handicap ranges from plus one on the very skilled side, all the way up to 36 on the, uh, you know, on the, you know, with some beginners and those that are new to the game. Um, and uh, you know, we also have a leaderboard structure where. Um, you can play as much or as little as you want, and we have three different leaderboards based on your amount of playing opportunities. So our members are really um, competing against those with similar skill levels through our uh, four different flights uh, based on your handicap, as well as uh, you know through uh, you're competing against those that have similar playing opportunities yeah. as well. Yeah, really putting the amateur and amateur golf aside. That's right. That's so, right. Sam, again, welcome to Chicago. Thanks Thank for you. being here this week, and uh, enjoy the rest of the weekend. Appreciate you having me. This is going to be fun.